Oh, look at the kingfisher. So sometimes it's good to spend a bit of time. Here's another one that's come back. They're doing relays here. Sometimes it's good to spend a little bit of time in a place just because things change around us. And this one is going to give James a very interesting challenge. James likes to try and follow things. We'll try. They're very quick. Obviously, kingfishers, in their hunting ability, they're very, very fast. They can sit in a little branch perching and then dart down and catch an insect. Now, what this one is doing is he's flying down into the water and he's touching the water surface and then flying back up. So he's doing his early morning wash. Well done, James. That is not easy to do. <laughs> it's very, very quick fly. You could see a very, very fast dive down, dips into the water and flies back up. See, maybe we can see it again. Watch under those armpits. You go a little forward, he keeps doing it behind the branch here. So our angle is a bit better this way. Such a beautiful bird. Those amazing turquoise colors on the wings. Obviously, keeping clean is important. One more. Ah, uh, awesome. No, he's, he's decided to make it even harder for you, James. He's flying in behind the tree. Oh, guys, that was very cool. Just dipping in, you get quite a lot of birds that wash that way. Uh, Fork-tailed drongos, well, a lot of your perching birds, birds that sit up on branches typically, they use that technique, just dipping down into the water and back up. Very nice. Well done, James. That is a, it's a tricky thing to follow. All right, let's go quickly before a herd of elephants and leopards arrive here and keep us occupied. Oh, just kidding, of course. 